Hello everyone, this is Miss Neha and uh, today we will continue with our lesson number 8, page number 585. In this lesson we will continue adding two digit number using strategies. We have learned three different strategies and we know how to add two digit numbers using the strategies. So before we begin our lesson, let us have a quick review about how to solve two-digit number by making a 10. Here, as you can see, we will add two-digit two numbers using place value method. As we know, in this number, 35 and 17, number 35, 5 is in ones place and 3 is in tens place. 7 is in ones place and 1 is in tens place. So we will draw tens and ones. So in number 35, we have three tens and we have five ones. One, two, three, four, five. In number 17, we have one ten and seven ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So now we will make a ten. We have learned. By taking 5 ones from 35 and 5 ones from 17, we'll make a 10. Let's circle it. We pick 5 from 35 and 5 ones from 17. So here we'll have one more 10. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We have five tens and the remaining we have two ones. So 35 plus 17 equals 52. Let's begin our lesson with the video which will help us to solve two digit numbers. Find 25 plus 17 in different ways. What strategies do you remember using to solve addition problems? Yes, we remember we use three different strategies. We use uh, blocks. We used drawing tens and ones and open number line. Some strategies include counting on, making 10, and breaking apart a number. You can use blocks. You can make a 10. How do the blocks show how to make a 10? You take five ones blocks from the sevens ones blocks in 17 and combine them with the five ones blocks in 25. So, how many tens and ones do the blocks show now? So, when we take five ones from 25 and five from seven, as we learned, five and five will give us one ten. The blocks show four tens and two ones. So, what is 25 plus 17? Select your answer. So, can you tell me the answer? How many tens do we have here? One, two, three, four. And how many ones? Two ones. Excellent. Our answer is 42. 25 plus 17 equals 42. You can draw tens and ones to find 25 plus 17. How does this picture show that another 10 was made? A ring was drawn around the five ones in 25, and a second ring was drawn around five of the ones in 17. This shows that a 10 was made. So there are four tens and two ones. You can add 25 plus 17 on an open number line. 
So here we know when we use open number line, we break the numbers apart. So let's try it. You can add 10 and then break apart the ones as easier numbers. Now you know how to solve addition problems using different strategies. So here we are done with the video. So now it's easy for you to solve the questions. Now you can use any one of the strategy to solve your two digit addition problems. Now here, let's take 36 plus seven. Solve 36 plus seven using any of the strategies you have learned. So we have 36 plus seven. We know that 6 is in 1's place and 3 is in 10's place. And 7 is a single digit number, so it's in 1's. So we draw 3 10's and 6 1's. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. And we have 7 1's. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So you know now what we have to do? We have to make a 10. So let's make a circle. We take five, five from 36. From six ones, we'll take five. And from seven ones, we'll take five. One, two, three, four, five. So now it's easy. Five and five will give us one ten. So we have how many ten, tens in all? One two three four we have four tens and what are the remaining ones one two three so 36 plus 7 equals 43 you can use open number line or you can use blocks i have used here ones and tens let's move on to our next page. Page number 586. Now here on the top of the page, as you can see, we can add 25 plus 17 using blocks or by drawing tens and ones, or by using open number line. Now find each sum, solve any way you choose, draw or explain what you did. The question number one, they have used drawing tens and ones. As you can see, 37 plus 24, we have three tens and seven ones, two tens and four ones. So we have to make a 10. So we have six tens in all and one remaining, so 61. Now let's go to the next question, 48 plus 10. How we'll solve it? We will use any of the method, which is easy. So over here, I will use an over number line. So here we'll start with 48. And we have 10, 48 plus 10 equals 58. You can use the two methods if it's easy for you. Let me explain you with one more example.